to go and uh, taste success at, at the Chelsea, Cheltenham Festival. Um, it's yeah, the, it's hard to sort of really put into words, but it's um, it's what we all want to, to achieve and, and strive to achieve. And so when it happens, it's very special indeed. I've grown up with horses. I love, I love riding horses. I love, you know, working with them. And, and that's, that's, you know, that's my favorite part of the job. My job is jack of all trades, master of none. The alarm goes off at 4 a.m. We plan what each horse does for the day and who rides them. And obviously I make a list if the vet needs to see any horses. Then I get my two girls up Ruby and Erin out the door, quarter to eight. Then I'm back here normally half eight, ride out three lots. Then after that, you so just look around if anything needs a bandage or has a cut or anything that's been missed throughout the morning and just look at them. She's very hands as you see, ride, rides not just Boot Hill, others as well, um, and loves working with the horses, whether it's the, those, those older horses, younger horses, breaking them in. As I said, wouldn't be doing it without her. It's a balance, really, because there's days when I think you know, something is bad and I'm negative about something and Harry will put a positive spin on it and then obviously likewise he those days when he's a bit down about something or and um, we can always kind of balance each other out. It's not all rosy. <laughs> There's disagreements as in any walk of life. So, um, but then that's what we're there to challenge each other, push each other further. So um, yeah, there'll be days when we don't agree and um, we have to cool off and things and uh, move on. And the girls love the horses. Ruby is only eight, but she can stand in the middle of the yard and tell you who every horse is and what boots they should be wearing or whether they need drawings. Or, um, she's, she's pretty switched on to everything. Love Envoy last year, we knew going into the race that she'd see the trip out well. We're lucky to have horses of that calibre, and yeah, we're up at all, all hours, um, out in all weathers, because it's for moments like that um, that is just, yeah, that's what it's all about. Um, uh, that's why we get involved in this sport, working with, with race horses. You know, she just doesn't know when to give up. So I would never, never say never with her. So we were delighted with uh, Boot Hill when he won the Wayward Lad Novices Chase. And um, obviously we've got the entry for the Arkel. Um, he is, is only the novice once, but we, we've sort of came up against uh, the red hot favourite for the Arkel in John Bonn in the Henry VIII. It's just a joy to watch him jump the fence. And it was just a pleasure to watch two really good horses going at it. And, and um, what I love even more is watching the races back and he's always one where he'll stand off at the wings, so it's, you know, it is exciting to watch. And this is Rock on Ruby, who's 18 years young now, um, and oh, he's, he's, he's a horse of a lifetime. He's 18 years young now, and to still have him here, um, being, being well looked after, enjoying his retirement, it's, it's great to have him about. Yeah, we've been very lucky to have uh, festival winners, grade one winners, um, but it's all about moving forward and not looking back and um, we've got a nice team hopefully to take us into the spring with with all our members of staff we, we need everyone here whether they're, they're mucking out feeding horses riding out it's everyone plays their part we can't do it without any any one individual yet yeah.